The topic of friendship is so inexhaustible. The reason is because it's the basis for all other relationships. One thing that I have done do you, very well in my friendship relationships is to be able to protect my friends apart from the time and the energy that I give to my friends. The reason why I protect my friendship relationship is because I usually think this is my thought though. I usually think that I don't know how to make friends and the few friends that I manage to make, I want to keep them. So I'm not this kind of friend who wants to lose friends. I'm always agitated, traumatized when I'm about to lose a friend. So I'm, I'm thinking, you know, please, I really don't want to lose these friends. So one thing that I've done well for my friends is to protect my friends, especially those ones that are male friends. Now, I protect them in such a way that say for instance, they now have a woman in their life, a fiance or a wife in their life. I make sure I do not usurp the position their fiance or intended or their married wife are taking. And that's the way that I protect my male friends, especially if we are not, we are not getting married and we're not talking about marriage. We are just being friends. So because we're being friends, I make sure that I protect him. I don't like to usurp that place. The way that I protect my female friends, particularly the ones that I've got fiance or that are married when their spouses are not my friends. And again, the spouses of your friends may not be your friends and you cannot force it. I've said that in my previous videos that don't expect that because you are a guy's friend, the wife of that guy or the fiance of that guy should be your friend. It is not possible. So the way that I protect the spouses of my friends make my friends secure in the sense that I make sure that if I want to speak to their husband, say for instance on a phone conversation, I go through my friend. I will never call my friend's husband <laughs> late at night and then we're talking, what are we talking? And so again, with friendship comes three things, time, energy, and security. If you can't get all of those things in your friendship relationships, I'm sorry, that friendship relationship should be checked. The reason is because all of these things are what God esteem or holds so dear. God is ready, always ready for us. And God wants us to give him our time and then our energy. Love the Lord with all your heart, with all your mind. That's what the scripture says. And then that's security. God will hold up his end of bargain anyway. So we should also hold up our own end of bargain and that's what is friendship really and those are the three things that i've realized and i have experienced as i make friendship with the lord and that has overflow informed my relationship or my friendship relationship with other people here on earth so again i thought i was going to throw this out today so have a wonderful day take care now bye